For every chapter in the Word of God, I'm going to ask a partner of this ministry to sow what I call a turnaround seed. I'm going to ask you to name this seed a turnaround seed. One thousand one hundred and eighty nine of the partners of this ministry I'm going to ask you to take a step of faith and I'm going to ask you to sow a seed with expectation but I'm going to ask you to name this seed your turnaround seed you see I believe over the next 60 days that there's an anointing for a turnaround right now that there's an anointing for a turnaround right now that there's an anointing for a turnaround right now the word anointing is a word false teachers use a lot to deceive Isaiah 10 verse 27 says the anointing lifts burdens and takes away yokes. If John really had the anointing shouldn't he be in the streets healing the sick, raising the dead, casting out devils and restoring hope to the hopeless? There's an anointing for a turnaround. A turnaround in your business. A turnaround in your finances. A turnaround in your family. A turnaround in your health. A turnaround in your health. A turnaround in your health. Todd is a liar. He wants you to believe sowing this seed of money would bring healing to you. Where in the Bible do we see Christ, Paul or any of the apostles asking people to pay before they get healed? I believe that if you'll use your faith, the season of your life will change. Isaiah chapter 43 and 44 says that, Behold, I'm going to do a new thing. The Bible says in Ecclesiastes 3 and verse 1, To everything there is a season, there is a time, to every purpose under the sun and under the heaven. I believe that this is your time. This is your moment to believe God. This is your divine moment. When you ask God for a miracle, He will always ask you to use your faith. When you ask God for a miracle, He'll connect you to a man or woman of God. Now, as we enter prayer time, I want you to listen very carefully because I'm going to come into a covenant with 1,189 because I'm going to come into a covenant with 1,189. Because I'm going to come into a covenant with 1,189. There are literally 1,189 chapters in the Word of God. For every chapter in the Word of God, I'm going to ask a partner of this ministry to sow what I call a turnaround seed. I'm going to ask you to name this seed a turnaround seed. I'm going to ask you to focus your faith. I'm going to ask you to wrap faith and expectation around it. And I'm going to ask you to believe over the next 60 days for God to give you a turnaround. A turnaround in your finances. Somebody's watching me right now that God's going to give you a business, a, con a business idea, a concept, even an opportunity that will catapult you to a new season. There's a person watching me right now that God's going to give you favor in a real estate transaction. Somebody is watching that this $100 seat is going to be a turnaround in your family and in your marriage. That this $100 seat is going to be a turnaround in your family and in your marriage. That this $100 seat is going to be a turnaround in your family and in your marriage. If sowing a seat of $100 will save your marriage, why didn't Todd ask his good friend Benny Hinn to sow that seed to save his marriage? There is an anointing right now on this $100 turnaround seat. You say, why $100? Because this is what I felt God told me to say to you today. I'm going to come in prayer with you. And I'm going to come into a covenant. I'm going to come into agreement. That when you plant this $100 turnaround seed into the work of God. You are creating a divine partnership with God. And something dynamic is going to happen. You're going to stand on the word of God. To Psalms chapter 91 and verse 10. Psalms, actually Psalms chapter 92 and verse 10, because I believe that there is a fresh, a new dynamic anointing that's going to fall on your life. I believe it's going to be a financial anointing. I believe it's going to be a financial anointing. I believe it's going to be a financial anointing. A financial anointing? If he truly had a financial anointing, why do you have to sow money into his ministry? Shouldn't he already have the ability to create wealth? And the Bible says in 90, Psalms 92 and verse 10, but my horn shall thou exalt like the horn of a unicorn, and I shall be anointed with fresh oil. This is going to be a turnaround seed that's going to catapult you to a divine season of flourishing.
Let's pray. Father, I have said to your family, to the great partners of this ministry, what you've told me to say. Lord, I know that you're stirring me to come into a covenant with 1,189 partners representing a chapter in the Bible. Lord, I come into a covenant in the name of Jesus with the 1,189, and I just speak in the name of Jesus for three miracles to take place from this $100 turnaround seed. I decree in Jesus' name that as you plant the seed that God's going to give you a turnaround in your business, that what's been stolen will be returned. What's been stripped from you will be restored. Number two, I decree for family healing and reconciliation, that that marriage will come back and be restored, that a child that's away from the cross of Christ in Jesus' name will be wooed back to the cross. And number three, I come into a covenant for a fresh and new dynamic anointing to fall on your life. And through this $100 turnaround seed, that every dormant seed you've sown in the last 18 months, that God will reschedule a season of divine flourishing, and they'll be resurrected. In Jesus' name, amen. And amen. There's a strong anointing here right now. I'm going to urge you to go to the phone. Dial the number that's on the screen. Do not delay. Dial the number right now and say, tell Todd, I'm one of the 1,189 partners of this ministry. I'm going to plant a $100 turnaround seed. I'm going to name it my turnaround seed, and I'm believing God to turn things around on my benefit, for my benefit. We're going to sow into your life the new book called The Miracle of Sea Faith. You're going to learn 31 secrets to seed faith living. You're going to learn things that you did not know. You're going to learn how to sow a seed and how to call into a harvest. Do not delay this. Quickly, go to the phone and dial that number. I have to pause for just a moment because there are 40 watching. that God is going to lead you to sow at a higher level. The Bible says, my sheep know my voice, another they will not follow. I'm going to ask you to sow an uncommon and rare seed of $1,000 to sow an uncommon and rare seed of $1,000. To sow an uncommon and rare seed of $1,000. There are 40, and I want to name you the favor 40. And when you plant this seed, there are three harvests that's going to happen. Number one, God is going to give you favor in business. Number two, God's going to give you favor in a real estate transaction. And number three, God is going to give you favor with somebody in a position to bless you. You don't need everybody liking you, just the right person liking you. If the right person decided to like you, your life could change in 24 hours. Did you know you're only one phone call away from a new season? There are 40 watching right now. The Holy Spirit's just dealing with me. 40. You're going to plant this seed of $1,000 based on 1 Kings chapter 3. King Solomon needed an answer from God. He planted 1,000 burn offerings, and in 24 hours, God showed up on the scene and said, What do you want? Now, this is not for everyone. There are 1,189. You're going to sow a turnaround seed of $100. But the Holy Spirit said that there are 40 listening right now during this broadcast. You're going to plant an uncommon seed of $1,000, and it's going to be a favor. See, this is what I'm hearing God say. He's getting ready to shift things around and let things work in your favor. When you call, don't forget to ask for the book, The Miracle of Seed Faith. It will change your life. Quickly, go to the phone, dial the number. And as you sow this seed into good ground, the gospel of Jesus Christ is going to be preached throughout the world. And God is going to give you a harvest beyond anything you've ever seen. So dial that number, sow your seed, and get ready. Because you're standing on the edge of the happiest season of your life.